at the moment. This is the first week, it's actually the third day of our brand new six week old piglets learning to race. So the piglet race in about a week's time will be the same for the next six months, which is where the pigs know exactly what's going on. They know the routine. They know that they run into the middle here, have a bit of a run around, look for any slugs and worms on the floor to eat, eat those, go into the starting crate, then run two laps of the track, over the jumps, down to the back corner, along the back straight, and then on lap two, they land in the trough at the end. They get their lunch, and then they go back into their pen for an afternoon nap. Um, today, and for the, probably tomorrow, maybe Saturday, this is piglet training basically where we just have to coax them around the track. All we teach our pigs to do is find their lunch. Once they've learned that lunch is in the trough at the end, they know that when they leave the starting crate, just run around the track as fast as possible and lunch is at the end. At the moment they're being coached behind by either Farmer Angelina or Farmer Faye and the other will shake a bucket of food, a bit like the hare at a dog race, to encourage them to run around the track. They then learn very quickly that the fastest pig to the trough gets the most food. The first pig there gets to put his head up in the air and wait for all the food to be poured straight down his throat. So that's what they want. They want to get to that trough as fast as possible. They want to be the first pig there. They want to get that biggest mouthful of food. So what we do when we first bring our piglets into the farm is we make them really friendly. So at the moment, Farmer Faye and Angelina are just giving a stroke and a tickle and they put the straps that the jockeys are attached to on their backs. Once they have been able to get these straps around their back, and I think they may have got our jockeys on. Yeah, they've got some jockeys on their backs as well. So this is the first day with jockeys on. Now, when we train our piglets, they don't use the saddle. They just have the teddy bears on their back. In about three or four days' time, they'll then have a big coloured saddle and a bigger teddy bear on their back. But while it's training, we put the smaller teddies on. Smaller teddy so bears. here they come. Uh, basically, when they're in here, have a look at them. Decide which pig you think is going to win and then cheer them on as loudly as you can. The louder you cheer, the more excited the pigs get, the faster they should run. So it's definitely best if you're piggy. cheering your pigs on really, really, really loudly. Oh, piggy. So today oh, we've got uh, Wonky Donkey the Grey Donkey on our little, little piglet here. We've got Pony McCoy the Brown Pony on this one. Um, on this side to my left, or was to my left, Lester Piglet the Pink Pig. And unfortunately we haven't been able to get one on our fourth pig, but we'll call that Walter Swim by on the sheep. We'll pretend he is on its back. The swim so machine. they have a little run around in the middle here. So you decide which pigs you think is going to win. Machine. So you can pick the pig, swim bar uh, which I think is a swim bar machine. Pig. Pony McCoy is the longest. Uh, we've got Wonky Donkey, and we've got Walter Swim Barn, who's technically not racing, but is racing. Have a good look at them. Once you've Walter picked your pig, bar. you must cheer them on as loudly as Walter you can. Swim the louder bar. you cheer, the faster they run. What's his name? Now, Walter here on the farm, we race What's our pigs for one reason, and one reason only, and that's to keep them entertained. Pigs are very, very intelligent, and they're actually a bit like children. When they get bored, they get a little bit naughty. And when they get naughty, they try and do it on a grand scale of escape and destruction. And they normally try and find Farmer Tony's garden, which is a fantastically flat green lawn, and eat it and dig it up and make it into a bit of a mud pit. And because he mows his lawn three or four times a week, he's um, quite particular about his lawn and the picnic paddock. We don't want the pigs going anywhere near his garden. So to keep them entertained, we give them lots and lots of things to do. And this is their favourite because it involves lunch. They get their lunch at the end. So the girls are going to try and encourage them over to the starting crate. Normally with piglet training, this turns into a bit of a fireworks explosion. Every pig goes, each pig goes in different directions and it looks like a fireworks display. But hopefully, on day three or four... The special one. We could be doing fairly well here, look. A little bit of gen well, Wonky Donkey knows which side of uh, side his bread's buttered. So he's straight in for his pre-race snack. The other three, they think, well, where's he gone? We need to find him. So they'll then try and find him. Walt in they go. Up. That's a good start. Walt We've got a good start to the race. Right, now they're in. I need to know who you think is going to win. So you need to cheer as loudly as you can Walt for the pig that you would like to win. Walt so, who would like Pony McCoy to win? Good start. Fantastic, well done. Uh, Walt Swimbun! Yay! Yay! Over here. A, Yay! Two or three over there, very excited about Walt Swimbun. Uh, Lester wow. Piglet! Yay! <laughs> we we were like the loudest. No. And uh, Monkey Donkey! Yay! Uh, no, always a firm no, favourite. So, no, no, the pigs Walt are in ready for their race. <laughs> to start the race, so really loud, on your trotters, get on set your trotters. and go. 
So, on your trotters. Pigs look ready. On your trotters, get set, go. Are you ready? On your trotters. On your trotters. On your trotters. Get set, go. Yeah. 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 And one to swim by the sheep at the oh, back there. He was third. He now, was third. Now, don't worry if your pig didn't win. That was just a warm up lap. That was just yeah. getting ready and ready to go. That was an exceptional race for piglet yeah. training. We don't yeah. tend to get that Still kind of reaction good, from them good, good. for about six or seven days. So it was a really, really, good. really good race. So now it's time for lunch. The trough's back in. They're ready for lunch. Are they ready? They're ready. Are you ready? Yeah. Are you trotters? Get set. Get So if you've actually walkie donkey, you are the winners. Now the pigs are going to have their lunch in the trough down here. We give them another scratch and a tickle just to get them even more friendly before we start the real race. And in fact, that was, I think we could call that a real race. That was a fantastic race this afternoon. Yeah. Uh, once they're finished yeah. eating their lunch, they'll head back into their pen for an afternoon nap. And um, thank you all for cheering on the pigs. Yeah. Yeah. Piggies! Bye bye the piggies. <coughs> Piglets. Well done. Let's stop.